Hey guys, it's Jenny here with Collaboration Nation here to make your Fridays fantastic. I'm wearing a tank top today because it's hot as Ryan Gosling here in Florida, which is super exciting because back at Virginia, I would be wearing all the clothes to try to keep myself warm. I'm currently back in Florida to celebrate Thanksgiving with my familia. I forgot the Collaboration Nation ball. It's back in my door and I'm sorry. So I don't have something to throw or catch. No blue. I'm walking on sunshine. Yeah. I need to work on my posture. They should call me Snow White because I'm pale. I'm high, but I don't even know why. Probably because I had a cookie for breakfast. Mmm. Real healthy. Cheers to our finest moments. See? Because it says congratulations. So I'm going ahead and answer the question in my way, which means that I don't actually answer the question. I don't think I've actually really truly answered any of the questions. Me answering the questions is kind of like me shooting an arrow and it missing by like two yards. It gets in the general area, but it just ne never hits the target. My finest moment, or if you were me, that's my finest year. I would have to say my senior year in high school. I'm a very fearful person and my senior year in high school, I decided that fear was the only reason for me to not do something, that I had to do it. And I called it no fear senior year. And because of that promise to myself, I went indoor skydiving, I was lead in a play, I spoke in front of a couple hundred people, was the chief of staff for my youth and government for all of Florida. Honestly, like I did so much and I was so proud of myself and it's really helped me now not come up with reasons not to do something, but for come up to reasons to do something because I realized how much I was missing because I was too afraid. Pro tip number seven. Just gonna go right along with the theme. Don't let fear hold you back from doing something. Honestly, you can do it. You go, Glen Coco. I'm a very scared person. Like, and my defense mechanism is I just fall into like the fetal position. I'm like a fainting goat. The worst defense mechanism in the entire world. Don't scare me now that you know that. <laughs> Every October, my college puts on a thing called Scare Mirror, which is basically like a big haunted house. And for me, who is terrified of all things terrifying, I was terrified to go. But because of my No Fear senior year, I said, of course, I will go. And I had a great time, even though I fell like 40 times because I was scared. I was holding on to two people the entire time. And if I got scared, I just would close my eyes. Everybody else was like, oh, that wasn't any big deal. I was scared. I was terrified. There was like clowns and stuff coming at me. It was like, no, no, I just don't do scary houses. Coming out of it, I was really proud that I went and that I conquered my fear, even though I'm still terrified of everything in there. So yeah, don't be afraid in college. You're gonna miss out on some great opportunities. Shout out to Brendan, who actually watches all of these videos. <laughs> I'm glad somebody does. I'm uploading this early just for you, so you don't have to wait till 11.59 to watch my video. Corwin, I saved this for the last bit of the video because I was afraid I was going to cry. I watched your video and was tearing up. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna miss you so much and I can't believe that we missed each other by like a day. We are probably like waving to each other on the airplane. You're like a brother to me and not having you here is so weird. I'm gonna miss you so much. And um, I put together a little something for you. Times are changing and so are we. Please don't forget to take our memories when you I don't want photographs, I want flesh and blood and bone And I wanna feel your heart, not hear your voice through the telephone oh. We're all leaving, going around the world I'm a bush garden ninja, what you gonna do? A red cheek rotten monster when I pit them kangaroos. I said red That's fine. But I love you all, and I will see you next Friday. I hope you have a fantastic day, and over out. Looking forward to the future, cause I know I'll see you again. And missed by a couple yards. Listen to me. My mom's calling. <laughs>